Hello to everyone. In this video tutorial, I would like to talk to you about how to download the software that is available free in the ComApp website and is useful to configure the ComApp controllers, plus also some interesting PC tools as it can be in Telemonitor or Winscope. Uh, to be honest, it's really simple to do it. You just need to enter in the website comapcontrol.com and log in. If you are not registered, you can register. It's completely free. And you can register like in any normal website. And the most easy way to go, there are two ways. I'm going to explain first one, the easy one, is if you have your product, you go to product, you find it. I'm going to do for parallel engine set controllers for intelligent NT. I just need to find my controller in the list of products, intelligent, intelligent and TBB. And here on the right, it will appear software. You just click on it and you will see all the files that are available uh, to download. The most important or the most interesting one, it will be this one, igsnt 30 installation suite. This is like a, a package that includes all the PC tools that are necessary to operate with a controller. So if you download and install, that's everything you need. Uh, what is the problem on that? That uh, we update it maybe one time per year or something like that. So maybe it doesn't have the last version, for example, for GenConfig or IntelliMonitor. Maybe you have the version here, uh, you have the version uh, 3.11. 3.11 and here in GenConfig the last one is 3.12 so that's why it's also available if you want to update to the last version are here also you can find the issue list and you can find specific packets to update uh, to upgrade your firmware that will be for example you can use the standard firmware 4.0.1 that is the last one you just need to download and install but you have some specific ones that it can be for rental, for hybrid, for PSC, for BDI, etc. So you can download and install. And the way to download is really easy. You just need to enter here to click in what you want to download. You will go to the website. Uh, you need to be registered and login. If not, it will appear the, the website to login. And you just click and it will start the download. Nothing more to do. The second way to do it, uh, to download some specific uh, software, is if you know what you want to download. You just need to go to support, download center software. And here you will have the list of all the software that is available in the website. It's loading. But it's like a mess box and it's a little bit hard to find something here so the best way is if now you know what you want to find for example last version for for genconfig you just need to put genconfig search and it will appear the last version it works also for example for the ecu if you want the last ecu list and here you have all the ecu lists for intellidrive for intelligent intellices for IntelliLite, Intelligent 200, etc. And that's almost everything you need to know. Thank you very much. And I hope that this video has been useful for you. Bye bye.